So today we are going to measure Manny, my mannequin. Let's get started. The first thing I always do is I come up here and I'm going to measure his neck. He is a 15 and a half. 15 and a half inches. Always leave two fingers inside. So you're gonna wrap it around and keep those two inside just to give a little wiggle room in his neck so they're not too tight. The next thing you're going to do is you're going to find that occipital bone and go across like this, across the shoulder, and then down to his sleeve length. He is a 34. So we're gonna mark 34. The next thing I the next thing I do is I always ask them to open up their arms and I'm gonna go in around their chest. This is their chest measurement and you want this nice and snug. Manny is 41 inches. Next measurement is the waist. So you're gonna come in at the tiniest part of his waist. He is a 35. You wanna give it a good tug so that it's Nice and snug. Then you're gonna reach in here and fill for his waistband, his natural waistband, not where he wears his pants, but generally where he wears his underwear. So you're gonna go in there and you're going to touch here and you go straight to the floor. He's tall, man, he's tall. He is 47 inches. That is not a normal measurement. That is not a normal measurement because he's on a, he's actually on a pillar. So, and then from there, let's see, what else do I need? Oh, 25, 35. Okay, those are all the measurements that I actually need uh, for me, but if you are measuring for a special order, you're also going to need the shoulder measurements and you're just gonna go around like this and go nice and snug and he is 47. And then you also need one extra measurement, which is his hips, and you're gonna go at the widest part of his hips. You're gonna ask him to open his, lift his arms up a little bit, come in here, and he is a 42. You're also going to ask him how tall you are. Manny, how tall are you? Okay, I'm gonna guess he's about, with the head on there, he would be, <laughs> he'd be like 6'4". Let's measure for a shirt. Now, shirt measurements are, your neck measurement, as well as your sleeve length measurement, which is from the occipital bone across the shoulder and down to the arm. Given those measurements to your formal wear dealer, they can convert those for you. Now, the 15 and a half converts to a medium, large, extra large, 1X, 2X, 3X, but they will convert them for you. Next, we're going to measure a jacket. A jacket is also two measurements. You need your chest measurement, which if you remember right, you're gonna lift up the arms and get that full measurement below, just up underneath his armpits. Remember, he was 41. And then you're going to ask him how tall he is. Now, if he is five, six or, sh or shorter, He's short. If he is 5'6 to 5'11, he's regular. If he's 5'11 and taller, he's a long. Um, and that will convert as well. Your foreign wealth store can actually convert that for you just by your height. So really for a jacket, you only need your chest measurement. A pant measurement is two measurements as well. You need your waist and your out seam for formal wear. It is not like it is with jeans. You don't do waist and then inseam. It's outseam. No one wants to go there to measure. <laughs> so just remember you want where their natural waistline is, basically where you're gonna put your hands on your hips, that's where you're gonna to wanna to start from. And then you're gonna go straight down to the floor. Um, remember, Manny was 35 by 47. 
So that, those measurements may be completely off from your gene size. Your Form World store can convert that for you. Generally, I take two inches down, so he would be at 33. The 47 is obviously skewed because he's on a, a pedestal and he's taller than a normal human. Lastly, let's measure for a vest. So the vest is just one single measurement and it's going to be the largest measurement in the torso region. If your belly is larger than your chest, then you are going to record the belly measurement. That is important. We need to know that you've got more girth through here. Giving that measurement to your formwear dealer, they can convert for you.